Hey you guys, it's Peter, and welcome to my channel! Peter! That's me. Boom, 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 boom. Bam! 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 Review stuff, and I am back for another review. I am sitting at the gas station right now because I was just pulling through, and I'm getting ready to go to Starbucks, so I thought, instead of going to the Walmart parking lot, I'm just gonna do it here, and then I will drive over to Starbucks. I am hoping, I am praying, I am begging, please! have the ingredients for today's drink because I am so excited to try this you guys no seriously I really am and I have to tell you it's 5 38 and I still don't have my coffee today so I'm gonna get my coffee as well but on totallythebomb.com Holly posted here's how you can order the secret menu Starbucks pumpkin spice hot chocolate to keep you warm this crisp this crisp I can't speak this crisp fall okay Fall is finally here, she says. And I can't find my favorite sweater. At least I, you can't. Well, girl, where's it at? Did you look in your closet? Oh my God. <laughs> Perfect girl, I can't find my own sweater. At least I have pumpkin spice to keep me warm. And she posts this very pretty picture, courtesy of Amazon, I'm sure. Uh, courtesy of Amazon? No, I don't know, it doesn't say. Um, I wanted to taste pumpkin spice and mix it with, I was gonna tell you guys that I just got my wreath in the mail from Amazon that's why I'm thinking Amazon see I, it's a big fall wreath it's so pretty on my Peter does stuff channel I'm gonna do a porch unveiling on Friday unveiling on Friday so you have to come over on Friday and see that I wanted to take pumpkin spice and mix it with another iconic warm drink for this crisp cool season I think that's actually really smart uh, this pumpkin spice hot chocolate will give you the best of both worlds, and you'd be surprised how good this combo is. Not me, I think it sounds delicious. Hot chocolate, pumpkin spice, I'm here for it all day long. Just grab our recipe card below. Okay, because it's not, it's on the secret menu drink, and there she puts another picture. Here's how you get it. How to order the pumpkin spice hot chocolate. Start by ordering a grande hot chocolate with only three pumps of mocha. Now, what I'm worried that they're not going to have is the mocha, okay? Add two pumps of pumpkin spice sauce and pumpkin spice topping. There you go. Now, if they don't have the mocha for the hot chocolate, I don't know what I'm going to do. This is super easy recipe to order. Okay, so that's all it is. So you just... It, you start by ordering a grande hot chocolate with only three pumps of mocha, and then add two pumps of pumpkin spice sauce and pumpkin spice topping. That's it. That is so easy. Oh my, oh my lord, there's more pumpkin goodness to try. Check out the pumpkin cheesecake frappuccino and the pumpkin patch. Oh, the pumpkin patch latte. I haven't tried that. That sounds like fun. Maybe we'll do that tomorrow. Okay, so let's go over. Now, I have to tell you, I will tell you that I've been craving apple cider recently. I don't know what it is. The last week, I've been really craving apple cider. So I might look up like an apple cider uh, secret menu drink to do, oh, my camera fell. It, uh, in the next week or the next couple days or something like that. But y'all love hot chocolate. Oh my God, I love hot chocolate so much. But I do think of hot chocolate as kind of like uh, a winter drink, so to speak, <laughs> you know? But I do, when I was a little kid, oh my God, my mom would, we would go out sledding and playing in the snow all day long. And then I would come in and my mom would make me homemade hot chocolate. Do you remember that? With like uh, the Hershey's stuff that comes in the can, the Hershey chocolate that comes in the can. And then she would put it on the skin it right and on the skillet <laughs> she put it in a pan a pan pot she put it on the stove you know what I'm saying and then she warm up milk and then she would put in uh, the her I think this was maybe the only thing she could cook and not burn uh, and then she put in Hershey's chocolate syrup and mix it in homemade on the stove and then um I'd also put those uh, marshmallows in it. My favorite marshmallows were the ones that were like different colors. I loved those, those were my favorite. Anyway, the big marshmallows, you know. And then sometimes she tried to give me those Swiss Miss packets and I wasn't very happy. Cause that Swiss Miss just tastes watered down. I don't like it. I will say their apple cider is really pretty good. I think they're closed. I think there's a sign over here saying they're closed. Damn it, <laughs> Janet, can't we have nice things? Okay. Are they closed? Oh no, their closed sign isn't out yet. So hopefully they're still open. Okay. Because I need my coffee. Oh, they'll be closed. Oh, they close it. Oh, oh, oh. Hi there, welcome to Starbucks. We're gonna get for you. Could I please get a venti iced blonde Americana with an extra shot and two stevia? No Splenda today, two stevia. Do you have Splenda? Oh, we do have Splenda. Oh, two Splenda then, yes. Yeah, two Splenda. What else were you, Peter? Okay, I have a question. Do you guys have mocha sauce? I do. Oh, awesome. Okay. So I need to order a grande hot chocolate with only three pumps of mocha. Okay. 
And then I need to add two pumps of pumpkin spice sauce. Okay. And pumpkin spice topping on top. And pumpkin spice topping. Anything else? No, but of course with the whipped cream for that place. Well, yeah, of course with the whipped cream. Oh, thank it's you so much. For you. That's it. Yep, nine seventy. All right, thank you so much. So this wasn't a super expensive drink um, because my drink usually comes to like four or something. Oh, they have a new joke here. I'm so excited because I haven't got to ask yet. The Veronica. Okay, why don't mummies take time off? Because they're afraid to unwind. Because they're afraid to unwind. That's cute. Okay. So what's going on today in the world of Starbucks? Uh, not much. <laughs> I love your button that says I wake up tired. That's literally everybody's favorite button of mine is the I wake up tired. Honestly, mine is this one. Which one is that? It's Captain, uh, Captain Picard. Oh, got it. Where he's just always baseballing. I think my favorite mate is, I may be wrong, but I doubt it. <laughs> I should get that for my best friend because that's kind of her belief system. I got it at Hot Topic. Okay, well, I'll go there and check it out. I cannot remember, though. Now, what time are you guys closing tonight? 7.30, our normal time. But what days do you close early? Okay, next week, Saturday and Sunday till five, Monday through Friday. What, what's going on next week? Um, as far as I know, we're just having staffing issues. Gotcha. Basically. Okay. Well, I see Jacob back there. Yep, he's the one making a drink. Oh, thank you, Jacob. And then on Sundays, we're going to be closing at six thirty, just uh, in general for Sundays. From now okay. On. Gotcha. I'm just happy you guys are open on Sundays. I know. Here's my coffee. Thank you so. Oh, thank you. Do you guys think you'll ever go back to the cups? Have you heard anything? Like, where we just hand you the cup? Oh. Um. But is that just because it's National Coffee Day? No, I think that National Coffee Day, they're just like, because you only get like a free pike or a free iced coffee if you get traversal coffee. Let me see that nail polish. I like that. Do you like it? What color is that? I have no idea. I can let you know next It's kind of a lavender gray. I love it. I put a matte finish on it. Look at you. Everything. 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 Have you guys given away a lot of free coffee today for National Coffee Day? I think it's really just a push to remind people that we are accepting again that's my guess okay but you have to come in right yes, exactly. so do you guys just have the thing over there where you just fill your own or whatever yeah, no, we have, it's, in here, it's just like we have this like no contact thing so like i could put your mug into like another mug so that way i don't have gotcha. to touch the whole thing and it's just harder to do that in dry through. so you can take you're accepting uh personal cups inside inside yeah. oh gotcha okay well that's good to know All thank right, you awesome. thank you where's your fiance today um, he is pulling trash somewhere well, we'll tell him i said hi <laughs> well, all right sure. bye so that's good to know about the personal cups. If you want to use your personal cups now, you can go inside to Starbucks and use your personal cup. So that's cool. I did not know that. I honestly didn't think they would go back to that. Okay. I gotta get somewhere where there's a little bit of shade here. Hold on so I can try this drink. Put, oh, put the Starbucks sign right in the back. Look at me. I'm basically a videographer of the world. Okay. Here we go. Yes, I do have a Metallica t-shirt on. Do you love it? I got it at Target. Okay. Um. <laughs> I mean, it truly does taste like if a pumpkin spice latte met a hot chocolate. But I have to be honest, I don't know that I love it. Yeah, I don't... Mm, it's just a three for me, I'm going to be honest, because, like, it makes me think, like, if I wanted a hot chocolate, I'd get a hot chocolate, but if I want... I don't know if this will make any sense, but if I wanted a pumpkin spice latte, I would have just got a pumpkin spice latte. I love the idea. I think the idea is super cute. And I guess for kids, so they could have like a pumpkin spice latte 
or anybody, I guess, that didn't want to have a caffeine, because my best friend, she hardly ever drinks caffeine at Starbucks. She always gets decaf. Um, she gets a decaf vanilla latte with an extra shot of vanilla, no whip. <laughs> That's what she gets. Um, I mean, I don't dislike it. It just tastes like hot chocolate with pumpkin spice syrup in it. But it does look pretty. You want to see it? Look at that. So, I don't know. Yeah, it's just a three for me. It's nothing that's that exciting. I'm kind of surprised. I honestly thought I would love it. But anyway, you can go try it and let me know what you think in the comment section below. And I love you guys. And I will see you when? Tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.